Now, forewarn weather with exclusive cutting-edge technology to help keep you and your family safe. Good Saturday morning, everyone. After some sunshine to end the week yesterday, we're going to keep some cloud cover, some sunshine and cooler temperatures into the forecast looking ahead throughout the entire weekend. Tower cam over at Metro Airport this morning, that cloud cover and you can see tower cam shaking just a bit as it's going to be breezy as we head throughout the start of our weekend on Saturday. We're starting off at 50 degrees this morning here in Detroit. Also 50 as you're waking up up in Pontiac, 49 this morning in Gross Eel and 52 starting off up in Port Huron compared to where we were this time yesterday morning. Most of the region running at least 10 to upwards of 19, 18 degrees colder as you're waking up and we are going to keep these fall like temperatures around as we head throughout the entire weekend. Our low pressure system from Thursday night into yesterday now moving off to the north and east into Canada and with high pressure close by over portions of Wisconsin and Minnesota. That's going to help to funnel in some of that cooler air as we head throughout not only Saturday but into Sunday as well. The greatest chance for those below average temperatures all the way from the Ohio Valley back into the northeastern United States thanks to that northwesterly flow wrapping around that upper level area of low pressure. But the fall like weather doesn't hang on long. We do see a warm up heading our way looking ahead into next week. Clouds and radar forecast keeps a little cloud cover in this morning but breaks into lots of sunshine through the afternoon and into the evening hours tonight. Upper 50s to lower 60s for a daytime high heading into this afternoon and with a mainly clear sky overnight tonight, temperatures are going to fall pretty fast. We'll drop into the 40s in the metro, but 30s are possible outside of the metro and some of our western and northern counties as you're waking up early Sunday morning. But with sunshine sticking around and the flow starting to work out of the south, we are going to warm things up about 10 degrees warmer by the time we get to Sunday afternoon and into Sunday evening. Then as of right now, I'm looking at a very weak disturbance rolling in Monday morning. That will bring a chance of rain showers as you're heading out the door to work or school Monday morning, but I don't think Monday's going to be a complete washout. We will see some sunshine as we head throughout the day on Monday as well. Then we start to warm things up pretty rapidly heading into next week. While we're into the 60s today, we warm into the mid 80s by the time we get to the middle of the week on Wednesday, and those warmer temperatures stick around through the rest of the week and into next weekend as well. The Climate Prediction Center's 8 to 40 day temperature outlook above average temperature for the majority of the lower 48 with the highest probability of those above average temperatures from Michigan back into the northeastern United States. So for today, if you are going to be heading over to Ann Arbor for the game, Texas in town for that noon kickoff, 50s for tailgating this morning. We warmed right around 60 by the time we get to mid this afternoon. Then the Lions game tomorrow, a big game. Rams in town at Ford Field. We're into the 60s by 6 o'clock in the evening, dropping into the upper 50s under a mainly clear sky toward 10 to 11 o'clock at night. Save the shower chance on Monday and a slight shower chance in our northern communities today. We're dry for the better portion of the next seven days with highs still into the mid 80s heading into the end of next week.